Good morning. Danny Eads, Chief of the Jesmond County Fire District. We're here today to show off the Pierce Enforcer, our engine 26. We just got in from order. Wanted to just talk about some of the features of this truck. Due to its location, we wanted to build an engine rescue body. Okay, so we need to have firefighting capabilities, but rescue capabilities due to the length of the time that their main station one is gonna to come to this station and help that other station out. So wanted to get all the rescue items that we could so they could operate on their own uh, while they're waiting on more help to come with other apparatus. So went with that rescue body. It's been a great, uh, great time working through Pierce with all the different issues that we're trying to accomplish with this truck. <clears throat> truck itself is 750 gallon tank. It's 15,000 gallon a minute pump. Easy layout, great job on Pierce's part with that. Multiple steps getting to the top because we did do coffins on both sides of the truck for that rescue need. It gave us several options to get to the top of this truck. As far as compartments go, multiple slide out trays, <clears throat> multiple drop down trays for those different rescue items that we may need all the way across the apparatus. Some unique things on the back, we wanted a low hose bed. We also wanted that 750 gallon tank. In order to do that, we needed to work with Pierce Engineering to make that happen along with, we wanted our ladders to be in the truck, not on the side. <clears throat> so to keep all that in order, uh, engineers did a great job of getting us that 750 gallons of water and getting our ladders inside with a low hose bed. Again, with multiple options to get to the top so we come around the truck, again, rescue oriented, did a carousel for our battery operated rescue tools. It's a great feature for this apparatus. Again, they're gonna be operating by themselves for quite some time in their area. Some airbag options, cribbing, uh, another pull out tray for our rescue jacks. You can see they come out easily. They hold plenty of weight and give you a lot of uh, variety and options for your tools. <clears throat> More steps to get to the top due to the tall truck. Lots and lots of storage areas on this apparatus. Pierce worked with us to engineer. We'll look, take a look inside the cab here and see what we worked with Pierce on. We uh, decided to add some more storage in the center console area, along with the med box. And then on the rear, underneath the seat, they've added us a small compartment for some more storage area. Also above on the roof, we added some uh, overhead storage. We just wanted to maximize our uh, comp compartment space in the cab also to uh, get as much equipment as we possibly could inside and outside the, the apparatus. So I hope you enjoyed looking at engine 26. We can't wait to get engine 26 back home and get it in service. We just want to thank Pierce for the great job they did on our truck.